Hey guys, welcome to a new custom game. I don't know if I would say new. Um, castle fight. I think a lot of you wanted to do that. Uh, ooh, what are we going for here? We have... Uh -huh. Am I saving... Uh, I'm gonna go vampire. Vampires are, fi uh, are fine for the beginning, I think. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, yeah. And is currently down, I hope just temporary. <laughs> I really hope just temporary. I don't know. Uh, it's still pretty early, so I'm playing some games of Battle.net. We will see. I think everyone is still here, right? And yeah, no one left yet. Good, good, good. So yeah, castle fight. Um, you build buildings and they automatically spawn those units every x seconds Where shall my blood be um and you can also buy like items for your builder and so on uh and we play 4v4 from my memory i remember that 3v3 after a while already gets very laggy <laughs> if the round takes very long though so 4v4 could be oh yeah uh interesting uh, most of the buildings also have upgrades. I don't know if I should go for that. They have import vampiric aura though. The thing is, we have. No, oh, those those are mine. Do we have any? Oh, we have melee. We have one guy with melee, and the others are ranged. We have the succubus and the light tank. The succubus seems to not be able to fight the fairy dragon, which I think have yeah they have healing. So we need some either better anti-air or I don't know like I, I will okay so I, I will I will help with the auras on melee with the life steal. We are currently pushing that's good. Uh, every team like every player has one rescue strike which deals a lot of damage in like a big AoE. Um, so yeah that's kind of the equivalent of the legion TD heals I would say. So uh, I will I will provide auras. What else do we have? Do we have anything? You are who? Kind of want to go flash golem though. That that should work pretty well with with uh, what I have. I just hope that people will not immediately leave. I don't know how long a round takes in Fallout 4. It should be faster than usual. I hope people stay for a second round. We we said that it uh, that you need two wins. He got an item already to blast stuff. That's usually what I go for as well. Um, that way you... You have a builder that can do something and help. Um, so they're counter pushing now. God, they have so many. We need... Anti-air. And I don't think I'm the right guy to have that. I don't have anti-air. Frost room, I think, is good, but it's 500. Forget about it. Did anyone get this item already? No. Uh, should I get it? Hmm. But yeah, these fairy dragons. That's an issue. That is way too many. That they uh, are able to get here. Okay, I can have the vampire lot now. On on ground, on ground we're winning. We are we're actually winning again on ground. The royal guards are really really strong. Um, just air we're losing. I will get the item if no one else is picking it. The thing is, you can't just buy like six of them and be be done with it. They have like a cooldown. So um I wanna get this as soon as possible if no one else gets it. Wait, we're getting pushed again on ground? I mean if if the fairy dragons help, yeah. <laughs> How much we can do. Do we need a rescue strike for this? Oh, 
I don't know what order we do. Uh, usually it's color order. Got all these fairy dragons. Oh, my parts are doing good though. Wait, do they do they split? Oh, when the when he kills a living unit, it will spawn a vampire from. Oh, that's what he did. Okay, that is very strong. Give me gold. Oh my god, that's so many fairy dragons. They're so split now. Okay. Let's help in pushing this out. They have double fairy dragon now, so we definitely need anti air. We need good anti air. Oh, the turtles can attack air, that's good. So yeah, this will shoot uh, one per second, 60 spell damage. Spell damage basically means. True? No, no, wait. I don't know. It's it's not true damage. It's it's probably like chaos, but it still um, affects the damage reduction. And I will have to work on mostly the uh, killing the air units, I guess. Making air is not good. Well, it's just anti air. Like even ground can be anti air. See, like I will go like this now so that I will mostly attack the fairy dragons. Oh, yeah, flying machines are good. Gyrocopters. Have a special anti-air attack, I guess. Okay, um, I guess I'm saving for either the flash. Ah, these are all good, honestly. Frostworm. I mean, uh, is is Frostworm really that good against air? Slaughter, like the flash golems would have more damage against buildings, I guess. Demolish. But this is also nice. Although they're squishy, the banshees. We have a good push now, though. Um, I guess I'm just saving. I'm, I'm saving so for some bigger stuff. I don't need to help there anymore. Um, I can only, with my build, I can only go up to this gate. I can't go further. But they will have to use a rescue strike for this, definitely. Because we have a really, really strong ground army. Yep. Oh, did they use two? Oh my god. Oh my god. That was bad. Okay, now now I will need my builder again. Um one thing you guys have to keep in mind. Whenever you play um castle fight, restart your game afterwards if you're playing something else. <laughs> because it modifies some game files, so it might be possible to uh Uh, that 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 it desyncs you on certain games. That that was the issue for a long time when you joined Legion TD after Castle Fight, for example. Okay, so we have mode no artillery, so that means I mean there's there's still there's also buildings that don't spawn stuff. Um like defense towers and like ultimate buildings, stuff like that. Um Simply to make the game go a little bit quicker. A tough greed, what does that do? That, that the one with the uh, succubus? What are they doing? Can you control units now? Greetings. Why can he control his units? Okay, that was the third rescue strike. I guess since we saved up for so long, um, I gladly obey. let's go Frostworms. The they should be able to attack both. Someone has left the game. That was not blue, that was one of them. But the AI takes over. Oh, of course. Of course everyone leaves. That is just classic in Battle.net. Yes, <laughs> master. That is just that is just so classic on Battle.net. That, that is why I hate Battle.net so much because it's so it's full with filthy casuals. Ah, that's Windows, and then I'm gonna join another game. But this is so classic on Battle.net. Like, 
It's just made for casuals. Where everyone can leave whenever they want and completely mess up the game for everyone else in, in that. Great. Um, there are, yeah, stuff like Orb of Lightning, for example, is very good because I believe you can even use it offensively. But actually, pushing now, though. Ooh. Pushing pretty hard. Need some area effects. I'll probably just get the next last stuff. I have two now. Uh, how do we do this? Yeah, someone's gonna use a rescue strike. They're actually leading an income right now. Blue goes next. Perfect. Calling it out. Since I'm purple, I should be the last one. Oh yeah, if you use rescue strike, of course you're getting a lot of gold, so you get all the kill gold. So uh, that can be quite good. No, no, don't, don't go further. So the thing is, the builder can also repair mechanical units. So you gotta be careful that he doesn't run into the enemy lines and then... I, I can show you, then he gets teleported back. Yeah. Killing 55 units, oh my god. He just made so much gold. He has 800, he has 900 gold now. Come on. Oh yes, Frost Rim is good against air. Oh, but they have a green dragon as well. Emerald dragon. Oh, but look at the Frost, look how tanky he is. Yes. Okay, I think if we win air, we, we win the game here. Because our ground looked pretty solid. Why are they also low? Uh. Okay, let's uh, get more frost rooms because then we definitely have the air advantage. Right now, it's hmm. They have so much anti air, to be honest. They have also zoo drakes. They have the red dragon, the emerald dragon, fairy dragons. Good thing though, the dragon turtles can attack air, so they they help a lot right now. But that means they're not really helping here, and my uh, vampire lords are not really helping either. Oh, tsunami. That, that's like a building he, he has, uh, like a special building, just like I have the uh, death pit for example, kills a random enemy unit instantly, or the city of decay, deals 10 damage per second to all non-mechanical enemy units, but I thought that I also need 1800 lumber, and lumber you get by uh, spending gold. Oh, it takes a while before I can do that, but you can see like if I build this now, I get I find lumber. And now I have two frost rooms. I could also like stop this and time them so they spawn together always, but they are kinda spawning together already. And now we're pushing and look at this. They have one more rescue strike, um, which they will probably use. That tsunami is strong. Is that that that's a that's probably I think that's his special building. Like that they cost like one I don't know what that is. Legendaries. Okay, but you can basically, we, we used to call it cheese, because if you buy cheese, you can get one more, like you can do two special buildings. There's also some upgrades, some, some buildings have upgrades that are special. Uh, I can't really show you right now, I don't have any. I probably have some. Um, I built a banshee, maybe that one has one. There's usually one unit building also that has a legendary lot that needs like a legendary. Um, let's get the Banshee. Your aura sounds good. Oh, they don't have an upgrade. Okay, let's go Flash Columns after that. Oh, they don't have upgrades at all. Okay, so they have two upgrades, they have two upgrades, they have one upgrade. That's all I have. Um, and we are doing... Are we pushing this? On air, we are definitely winning now. And as soon as we win air, we can help against ground as well. And I believe that slows attack speed as well. 
So I would say that's very useful for our ground units to win that as well then. Although we're probably getting pushed right now. I'm really like, why did, why did they all leave? Like, actually, I think one state. I don't know about pink, if, like, what that means. Um, it's really annoying. <laughs> really annoying. They just, just play it out. Like, I don't know. Have fun. Learn. And don't just be like, oh, 10 minutes, uh, let's, let's leave. Like, this is not. Uh, like, I don't know. It's stupid. I, I don't even care playing against bots in the end, because bots might even be better than, than people who just leave instantly. Let's get that flush golem. But I really need to get some of these buildings because they have more upgrades, so can maybe show you the legendaries. Flesh golems seem pretty decent though. Uh, oh, we're here now. We could get the next blast stuff. On next income. Yeah, I'll quickly get that. I don't even know if I needed to uh, get close to that building to buy it. Oh, who used that strike? That was not the best one. <laughs> Yeah, I want I want to deal with the air first. Make sure that like winning air is easier than winning ground right now. As soon as we have that, like our air will will do it by themselves, and maybe it's this ground. Oh yeah, of course, uh, repair. You can. Well, I can even repair the flying machine. Let's not be an auto repair because then we will run out of range. But we're pushing now, and I still have my rescue strike. So uh, that's good news. Oh damn, the air is coming. Uh, I want the orb of lightning. Oh, someone else got it already. Okay. Uh, did someone already get this? If not, I will definitely get it. Wait, where, where is everyone's builder? Red. Where's, where's everyone else? I don't know. I'll just get it. That's a big buff. Um, and then what, what you have as well here is... Um, for like 30 seconds, double damage and quad damage. That usually... That can definitely change the outcome really quickly. With with that you can you can one shot the base in like one second. If the enemy isn't uh, taking care. I don't think this is uh, um, this has uh, infinite range. I think this is global. You can see if some new units spawning have that. Yeah they do. But someone got this already, I got this. Um, so I guess we were good. Let's get the other buildings that we haven't seen yet. I haven't built any special buildings yet, but raised that is, well, a random type skeleton is probably just mass units. Death Pit, I mean, with how much mass they have, isn't really working. City of Decay would be very good, but I don't even have 1800 lumber yet. So zombies can be upgraded to suffocated zombies. They can be upgraded to plague bearer. Necromancers can be upgraded to mighty necromancers. Just want to see if I have one um, on legendary. Oh, I do. Look at this, Lich King. That sounds good. Wait, are we actually getting pushed? Are we losing against the bots? I mean, the bots. I think the bots aren't too bad. They're at least, like when the game lags, they're definitely the, the superior choice because they don't feel lag, so they <laughs> still build. Uh, I need a lightning. 
How are they counter pushing this? How are we losing this? Surprise is not lagging yet. We're not at the point yet, I guess. Let's go in auto repair. But we have like almost no units doing that right now. Um, yeah, I have my rescue strike, but the question is where do I use it? Because we have two different fronts right now. I'll get my special bullet. I got the sick city of decay. That has to help. Just before we die, I hope. Come on, kill something. Okay, I'll wait for the income. And uh, yeah, that can also destroy buildings. So if you build buildings here, they would definitely attack them before the castle. So City of Decay. 10 damage to every non-mechanical unit. Meaning they should just all die. Not gonna, it's not really dealing 10 damage though. Because I think it, it, it keeps... Um, it doesn't ignore armor. Um, I actually need more lumber now to get this as well. Uh, actually for this I need cheese anyway because I just used my legendary. Uh, what can I possibly do that's helping me? What are the Banshees doing? Uh, let's get some Banshees. Or maybe more Vampires so the Aura doesn't die immediately. But I think we're pushing again. Even without my help. Oh yeah, mechanical units. Heal them. I mean, repair them. <laughs> they can't be healed. Oh yes, we're doing good. Get orb, please. You mean... No, what does he mean by orb? Oh, treasure boxes are activated. Oh, that's a good way of getting income. Because uh, they give you a percentage extra. I'm, I'm really far behind in income to be honest. That's because I bought these items early on. So I spent my gold early on on uh, something else. That looks pretty good now. Still have my rescue strike. Or if they actually counter push. So we should have them this time. We can also use these items so should help. Have gold again though. I might be lazy and just build it here. I'm lazy. I'm very lazy. I want them on the front. But yeah, at this point it's a lot about those special buildings that like you see they shoot those ice crystals for example, we have the tsunami wave, all that kind of stuff. They have flame strike. I think one of their units has flame strike. If you mean rescue strike, no. But you can see it up here. But yeah, they have like a flame strike. It doesn't affect buildings apparently. Oh my god, are we actually getting pushed? I'm gonna lose that building then. Double damage rune, double damage. And I don't want to use my rescue strike, so I, I, I'm okay with spending 600 gold on taking my building as well. We still have double damage? Yeah, we do. But how did they counter push? That's that's the question I'm asking myself. How did that even happen? To be honest, at some point you don't really... It's hard to keep track of what's going on. 
It's really hard. Where's my builder? Somewhere in here. Because he's repairing. Like, they have so much area damage to clear. Like, look look how low they get us. <laughs> how did my worker leave it now when, when I told him to hold position? I, I just want to make sure I have the auras on uh, first front. I'm building vampire lords here. I, I might even build um, a defense tower. Can I start a second one? Yes. Can I start a third one? Oh my god, all the skulls. I'm making some good money now. I, I, like, honestly, I'm full YOLO this way. Usually you, you do not build towers to... Like, to offense, offensively push. You do that when you have like no rescue strike left and you need to defend your base, for example. I'm not even sure if they're viable at all. But it seems to help. I really don't want to use my rescue strike. Um, I think you cannot use rescue strike. I th don't think it has infinite range. So that works a little bit different, but I think here I could still use it. Let's get some frost worms. Although our and our air is really strong now, but I just I just want some frost worms also helping the ground units. Although on ground, I think what we miss on ground the most is melee. Like we have so much range. Look at this, but. They are all squishy, right? So if they use spells, then we are in trouble. Um, so yeah, I guess I needed to go more on melee. More flash golems. 27 minutes? You can see though why the game could possibly lag later on, right? <laughs> because there's a lot of stuff going on. I like this game. I should maybe play it more often. Maybe. It looks like they're counter pushing this now. Uh, uh, we're losing like all our units, kinda. Just explosions everywhere. There's no heroes in this game. By the way, in case you wanted to know. And no real like upgrades like of course you have a lot of different units that have like auras but you can't directly upgrade certain units as in like they always have more attack damage or something like that <clears throat> okay uh, I want to get the more treasure boxes Boost my income a little bit. I think I'm, I think I'm back on uh, average now with my income. It was about time. Uh, all of lightning. Is it available? Yes, it is. Okay, let's get this. Let's end the game here. Damn, thirty minutes. Crazy. Okay, so Orb of Lightning you can cast like this. Then it deals 1000 damage and then like, I think 900, 800 and so on. I don't know if that's the uh, exact values. Um, yeah. Every 60 seconds, something like that. The uh, cages are probably not working. So there's this... Um, there's like what what he did here. Like usually that that works, but I don't know. <laughs> um, there's something like like you can you can trap the units and then release them at the same time by destroying one building. That is usually very viable to do. Um, but I saw these units like just run through. Yeah, like at some point they're just running through. Uh, let's enter game here.
Oh, we already bought quad damage, okay. Mm. Buying double damage then? Do we have quad damage? No, we don't have it active right now. It was used before already. Uh, Orb of Lightning. Eh. And those flying units, they're annoying. Okay, maybe spend my uh, gold. Just maybe. Oh yeah, I think because we play an A mode, no artillery, that means uh, they can't build buildings that would damage buildings. Because that gets really annoying at some point, where the enemy is just building mass like anti-building and it's, you just destroy each other's buildings. Kind of annoying. I'm a casual, you know, so for me that's annoying. But let's just test if we can use a rescue strike here, but I guess we can't. Uh, let's just use it here. Yeah. The unit to be like in range. So my builder is running there now and it's not going to be able to do it. Yeah. But this should be... How are, we, how are they counter pushing this? How are they counter pushing this? I don't even see any auras on them. <laughs> How are we losing this? I don't get it. Okay, how good are the necromancers? Can I even find them here? Legendary sparrows is immune, decaying attack, raise ultimate death. That sounds good, but I need to buy a cheese and that's not even available right now. Let's just get some uh, cheaper necromancers. How are we losing this? Crazy. I have to stop them all manually. To upgrade. The race ultimate death, I'm guessing that raises a very strong unit. We play till the very end. That's very important. Uh, I don't think it stacks if you have multiple orbs. I think uh, only one can do something at a time. Well, that lightning was strong. I only need one unit. Because I know there's no other unit in the range. Okay, what can we do here? Um, let's get some death pits. Honestly, why not? We're building everywhere already. Look, look how much we built. Usually, we mostly build on the opposite side because we set like one lane only, so everything goes our bottom lane. Um, so you build there that the buildings don't get attacked. But now we're just like Yolo. Raise that building I could maybe build. Or even as an upgrade. That could actually be interesting. Let me build that. Hundred forty. Gal Shrine. Okay, go for it. <laughs> we get so much gold now. So much gold. 34 minutes. That's pretty long for a, for a castle fight game. What, are, what should I build? What is the plague bearer? Wait, where do I have this? Is it any good? I, actually, I might get a couple of those. They could maybe help. Okay. Uh, I, 
I, I don't know how, but they are just counter pushing. Maybe because they built so many towers. Like usually this is what you build, you cage and then you re erase one building and then it could run out and stuff like that. Um, they have like a lot, like they're, they're messing so hard those anti-air units and those archers and defense towers. And as soon as we get in range of those, we're just getting melted. Can I buy cheese? No. We could build quad, uh, we could buy quad and double damage though. Very soon. Someone has left the game, okay. That's good because that means only the strong PCs survive. If at the very end it's, it's only me left, then I think I have a good cho chance of ending the game at some point. Okay, they lost their last player as well. Honestly, I should go for the uh, damage upgrade now. I think we can do it now. I want to get this first. It starts lagging now. Like, honestly, the FPS is going down. I can also show you the FPS counter. 18 FPS, that's that's good. Um, kinda want to get ready to finish this. What do I buy cheese? No, cheese still. Oh, someone already bought it. Uh, come on, end this. Someone even bought this again. That's my stack, don't buy twice. <laughs> I don't know who thought that would be a good idea. No one. Like now now they have look look how much damage they have. Look at this. They just need to get in range of doing something. They just need to get close to the building. Because the building is squishy. Okay, that attack is actually anti buildings. You see how much damage this gyrocopter does? He does five hundred siege damage. Come on, this has to be it. I don't want to build now, I want to just see the base fall. Oh, they lost the damage buff already. Oh, we just, we at least we destroyed some buildings though. So, uh, in the long run, that should be good. Yeah, those, those dry cops are actually, they're not anti air, they're anti buildings. This is an anti building attack. Nice. If we had two Gyrocopters attack the castle, that would be nice. 3000 gold. Okay, let's build some more. Just gonna queue this, I might have enough gold already at that point. Never mind, okay. So, um, are we winning this or no? We destroyed a decent amount of buildings down here. You could all see their income go down because of that. <laughs> Come on. Gyrocopters, yes! Finally. Okay, um, who has most kills? Oh, it doesn't say. Oh, no, it says blue, 1638. <laughs> okay, well, that took a little bit longer, 38 minutes, 48 seconds. For 4v4, that is pretty long. <laughs> and there's only like two guys left now, so uh, I'm like, this is enough probably. I have 240 FPS. What? Warcraft can have that many FPS? Now I'm the last one. Okay, thank you very much for watching, guys. That was very interesting castle fight. Um, that's the problem with Battle.net. People always leave, even though it was just such a friendly game. <laughs> I think the bots played better than those players, though. Um, anyway, thank you very much for watching. And um, I will leave now because I'm the last player anyway. Uh, maybe I'll play this again.
you next time. Bye.